Hello. My name is Charlie Smith, and I'm here at Coolidge Middle School to talk to you about Charlie Brown Day. The whole idea behind Charlie Brown Day is to bring in the history of pie, the significance of pie, some fun with pie poems and other ways to look at pie, so that the kids really learn the relationship, the ratio, and it's carried with them. Now, on Charlie Brown Day, what we do is we use that to discover pie. Charlie Brown has a big round head, and so because of his round head, we decide that his favorite subject is geometry. And that was his favorite subject in school, so it's only appropriate that on Charlie Brown's birthday, we do something with circles. So the kids come in and we have a big party for Charlie Brown on that day. We start out by they bringing something that's a circle as a ticket to get into class, and then they go through the same things that you have probably done in your class, where they, dis where they measure the circumference and they measure the diameter, and then look at the ratio and discover pi. But after they discover pi, we're not finished because we make sure that we try to get them involved in pi in a lot of different ways. We do a Charlie Brown walk around a big head of Charlie Brown down in a multi-purpose room. We write pi poems. We talk about the history of pi with the ancient Egyptians and Greeks. We sing pi songs and culminate the day with a big Charlie Brown pie. Welcome to Charlie Brown Day. What's his favorite subject? Geometry. Math and geometry, right? What's the definition of a diameter? Circle's longest chord. So when you're measuring, some people were measuring off because they didn't find the longest chord, okay? You can't always see the middle of your circle. You have to find the longest chord. Measurement is not easy. Take this seriously, please. So I think that's like 7.4 maybe. What do you think? They're practicing being bematists, surveyors in ancient Egypt. So they all walk at the same pace. But I want you to think about what this is telling us. It doesn't matter if the circle's as big as Charlie Brown's head or those little circles we were measuring in class. A circle is always in the same proportion. Three times the diameter is always going to be the circumference. Right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, My feeling with math is that I get a lot of kids coming from elementary school who either in a category where they don't like math, it's okay, or they love it. I like to see the kids who come in not liking math leave thinking it's one of their good subjects. The kids that come in liking it, I want to leave loving it. And the kids that come in loving it, I want it to be their future, because math should be their future. Oh, number five, oh, number five.